Hello everyone, in this video we're going to learn how to add more IP cameras or IP devices to a PoE and VR with a PoE switch. We have this question a lot when we have like full capacity PoE and VRs like this one right here. All four ports are used and what happens if we want to like add a camera like this to our system? Well there's a blunt solution, you can just get another PoE and VR or you can buy a PoE and VR with more ports. Either way, they cost a lot of money and you might waste a little because this one might just be you know, wasted. So, we have a very ideal situation where we just use a PoE switch. A little tiny PoE switch can solve all our problems. So first we get our PoE switch. And since this one has two uplink ports, we're going to connect our PoE switch to our main network. And then we're going to connect our PoE switch to our MBR. Once this connection is made, right here, uh, we're going to power our PoE switch. And now we should be able to add this camera to our whole system. So we get our Ethernet cable. Ethernet cable gives us this camera power and data. So, one end to the camera. And another to the PoE switch. After this connection, as we should hear, yep, it's self diagnosis. Nodding yes and no. And let's just wait for the image to show up. You can see there is an image now. My hand's waving here. So we can say this whole camera is very adaptable with this PoE and VR system. Alright, and that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any more questions about this or comments, please leave them at the section below. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.